It's a brand new day, so come on and play in a world that's waiting for you. We're about to begin, so come on in. There's so much to do at school, and you can do anything if you try. With friends like Timothy by your side, there's a new adventure in everything we do. We'll all be together, and you can come too. When Timothy goes to school. children. On Friday evening, Hilltop School will be having an open house. An open house? What's that, Mrs. Jenkins? An open house is for parents and friends of Hilltop School to come and visit us. They're coming here? To see us? Yes, and I'd like everyone to make a science project to show them. Mrs. Jenkins? Yes, Lily? I have a plant that eats flies. Can I bring that to the open house? Yes, that sounds very interesting, Lily. I can show everyone how to make rainbows. I'll do something with snakes. I'm going to make an experiment that shows how a rocket works. A rocket? A real rocket? One that flies into outer space? It won't go that far, but it can fly up in the air. Wow. I can't wait to see it. That'll be great. Fritz knows everything about science. He's going to be a professor. Yeah. Professor Fritz. Hmm. Professor Fritz. I like that. Hmm. Interesting. Oh. Are you making a cake, Mom? Uh-huh. It's chocolate fudge, your favorite. Don't you need eggs to make a cake? Yep, two of them. Here, Mom. Oh, thank you. Are you working on another experiment, dear? How did you know? Oh, <laughs> just a lucky guess. If you need me, I'll be in my lab. <laughs> and now, Professor Fritz's special rocket fuel. First, some baking soda. And then some vinegar. Professor Fritz to space control. All systems are go. What's in the box? It's my science project. Wow, that's a big science project. I'm starting mine today, too. I'm all finished. You're finished? Already? I started working on it after school yesterday. You can see it at Show and Share. That's when I'm gonna have the test flight. Test flight? Today? I can't wait. I made the launch pad from an egg carton. This is the engine where the rocket fuel burns. Wow! Rocket fuel! Well, it's not real rocket fuel. I'm using baking soda and vinegar instead. This is the fuel injector. It sends the fuel into the rocket engine. And this is the rocket. Wow! First, I have to add some fuel to the engine. Oh, no! 
It looks like a safe landing. <laughs> it looks like a failed landing. I am a rocket. I am a rocket, too. <laughs> that was funny, Professor Fritz. <laughs> I wonder who it will land on at the open house. <laughs> <laughs> Let's all pretend we're rockets. <gasps> Come on, Professor Fritz. Pretend you're a rocket, too. <laughs> Professor Fritz. <laughs> no more Professor Fritz. We need help, Professor Fritz. Yeah, we need help making our science project. I think you should ask someone else. My ideas don't work. Hey, Lily's going to feed her plant. Come on. I want to see that. I do too. <laughs> <laughs> what are you feeding it? Muffin crumbs. I couldn't find any flies. Muffin crumbs? Your plant likes muffin crumbs? Watch! Wow! It likes muffin crumbs! Yeah, it is really hungry! Can we feed it? Okay, but don't feed it too much. I want it to be hungry for the open house. Come on, Lily. Let's go see Yoko make a rainbow! Okay. I don't see anything. Neither do I. Look up there. On the ceiling. There it is! When the light shines through the prism, it makes a rainbow. That's pretty. I like rainbows. That's a wonderful project, Yoko. Thanks, Mrs. Jenkins. This can be our win. Mrs. Jenkins, look at the weather vane that Claude and I made. It points in the same direction that the wind blows. Wow! Excellent work, Claude and Grace. What are you doing, Charles? My project. It's about magnets. It looks great. Can I try it? Sure. What did I do wrong? A pencil is made of wood, so it doesn't stick to the magnet. But this dime is metal, so it does stick. It's magnetic, and so is this paper clip. Wow, I didn't know that. Can I see your project? Sure. I still have one more snake to do, but I ran out of green paint. Come on, I'll help you look for some. Look, Timothy. That's Fritz's rocket. Why is it in the garbage? Fritz, why is this in the garbage? You can have it. I don't want it anymore. Huh? Why not? I'm working on a different project. I'm going to show how a bean sprouts instead. But we already did that in school. That's why I'm doing it. I know it works. But your rocket experiment was great. If it was so great, why did everyone laugh at me? We weren't laughing at you. Yeah, we were laughing at the balloon. Well, I don't want it to happen again, especially at the open house with the whole town watching. And my mom, too. But everyone wants to see your rocket launch. <sighs> They'll just have to watch my bean sprout instead. What was your rocket supposed to do? It was supposed to go straight up, all the way to the ceiling. What went wrong? It went crooked. Well, how does a real rocket go straight up? A real rocket has fins at the bottom. Like these. Too bad you can't put fins on a balloon. Wait a minute. Maybe I can. Thanks, guys! What did we do? I don't know. This is a garter snake. 
I found one just like it in my backyard. This snake is sticking its tongue out to taste the air. And I made this rattlesnake out of clay. It's lying in the sun to warm itself up. Well done, Timothy. We learned a lot about snakes this evening. It looks like Nora is ready with her project. With this tube, I can move water from one glass to the other. It's called a siphon. You can use it to change the water in a goldfish bowl. Excellent demonstration, Nora. Thank you. Our next presenters are Frank and Frank. I can make a balloon stick to the curtain. I can make a balloon stick to Frank. <laughs> Thank you for showing us the effects of static electricity. And our last presenter this evening is Fritz. My experiment shows how a rocket works. He's going to do it, Charles. First, I have to add some fuel to the engine. Five, four, three, two, one, blast off! Oh no, not again. <laughs> That's what happened the first time I did the experiment. Then I figured out what went wrong. The rocket needed some fins to help it go straight. Five, four, three, two, one. Well done. Great launch, Fritz. You mean Professor Fritz. 